So there is no way you're going to talk about Ghana without talking about Nigeria. You understand? I mean, you know, Ghana and Nigeria are more or less like a brothers. They almost have everything in common. I mean, let me not talk about Ghana Jollof and Nigeria Jollof. You understand? Now, that is not the reason why we are here. I mean, we are here to talk about music. We are here to talk about Ghana music and Nigeria music. You understand? Now, there is this video trending on social media that this guy is saying that the reason why Ghanaians musicians are not recognized or they are not getting its song globally is because they refuse to join the trend of Afrobeat. Obviously, Afrobeat, I mean, Afrobeat is the big hit now and you cannot take Nigeria out of Afrobeat. I mean, it is, you can't dispute Nigeria's made Afrobeat globally. No two ways about that. It is what it is. So basically what the guy is saying is for you to get a hit song globally, you need to join the train. I mean, it is a moving train. So you need to join the train to get the hit. Or if you want, you can take the Afrobeat and fuse it with your local music to get a hit or to be recognized globally. I mean, he did say that of course, the DJs and the presenters in Ghana play Afrobeat, even though most of Ghanaian music, I mean, most of Ghanaians don't like Afrobeat. But the DJs and the presenters play the Afrobeat. So, for you to join the team or for you to get an eight song, you need to do the Afrobeat or you need to take the Afrobeat and fuse it with your music to get a global. Now let's watch the video ourselves. After that, we'll continue our conversation. Okay. And by doing that, no, indirectly, it's killing our music. And who is it to be blamed? It is not the Nigerians. Of course. We have to blame ourselves. You see, the problem is because of the global acceptance of Afro beats. Exactly. Ghanaian music has collapsed. Hmm. Exactly. And they sound good to the people. Mm. But they cannot move like they normally move to Ghanaian songs. Exactly. They cannot dance with it. Yes. Man. So now, the people are waiting for the Afro Beat wave to pass. It can be they possible, can bro. Exactly. So it is only right that you as a Ghanaian, you jump on that wave and mm. deal with it. It's a moving train, bro. You are waiting for Nigerian wave to collapse so that you Ghanaian, you can bring your style. Mm. You are wrong. Mm. The car is moving. moving. Now we have reached the global platform. Mm. Exactly, that's what I'm saying. To just sit back, doing the old stuff, but the people don't want to hear it at that moment. So, guys, I mean, you heard what he said. I mean, I personally, I, I second him. You understand? Because now, Afrobeat is a big Afrobeat is a ish globally. 
can't take that. So don't wait for it to be collapsed to fix your own death. No, it doesn't work that way. So if you can't beat them, you better join them. So you better join the train. Now, like you said, we are the global platform. So how? You can't. So the best thing you have to do is to what? To join the train. To, I mean, do the alphabet. If you don't want to do it, just take it. Fuse it with your own. I mean, your high life, your hip life. Just put it inside. Mix it. For example, I mean, I'm a piano. Eh? I'm a piano. I'm a piano. is for South Africans. Yeah? But Nigerians were able to take it. They put in their own. They fix their own in to make it big. You know, you brought it. They, they can make it big. No two ways about that. So the best thing we have to do is do what? I mean, do the Afrobeat to be recognized globally. Tell me what you think in the comment section below. But remember, don't forget to hit the subscribe. You can also comment, like, and share. Be safe. Be kind. Spread love. The world needs love. Let's meet when we meet. Peace.